So it's my last day here. I'm in the elevator. I got my stuff. Uh, all I got is a rod with a Zabiki rig, my GoPro, my waterproof case, and my buff that goes on my neck so I don't get sunburned. Um, I'm going to go talk to the guys, see if uh, it's 8.30. They, they won't let you start using or they don't. I'm not sure if they've been there, but the kayak's still online. So if they're there, I'm going to see if I can convince them to let me start using them half an hour early. And, you know, make, make me the little whiny baby. See if they let me start using them early. If they do, I'm going to head out there and just play with the little uh, googly eyes. Because those things fight like a beast. And uh, if not, well, I'm going to chill in the pool, do something else till, uh, till it's time. And I'm only going to have half an hour before I have to go. So, yeah. So I'm going to go see if uh, they're there. You know, let me use them. If not, let's see what happens. There. Let's see what we'll do. Zabiki rig strikes. One, two. Same thing. Hey, look at those things. Where's the guy's mouth? That guy has teeth. Same with this guy. So I'm kind of a little nervous to unfold them. So let me see if I can... Uh, Set my phone there without it falling. Ooh, hoo, hoo. how do I hold these things? They have spikes on their back. No. You're not helping your case. You're just hooking yourself even more. Now you're hooked from next one. You're not, you're not helping your case, my friend. Mm -hmm. You're wrapped for one. Hundred percent I'm scared to grab this thing. Hands are way too close to that mouth for my liking. Look at that. Look at those teeth. There we go. Ooh, and he's in the sand. Look at that. Back in. Okay. Right behind the head, just like a snake. Look at that. Look at those teeth. Okay, let's go let this guy go and then we'll come and get to the other one. <laughs> That's one. That's one more to the list. I don't know what it is, but you know, that's one more to the list of shit we have caught. Behind the mouth and there's the water he goes. Dude, and he's gone. Oh no, he's not. He's right there. Why ain't you gone yet? There he goes. Now let's go get his friend unhooked. Ooh, 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 ooh. Sand is really hard to run through. Okay. Buddy over here though. He's not happy. I mean I wouldn't be either if I had a hook in my mouth, but you know. Ooh, he took it in further. And I think if he did, he's not in this. Ooh. Yeah. He ate it a little bit better. Whew. And I'd prefer not to get bit by that. Look at that. Look at those teeth. Ooh, you got me. So, I'm going to try to unhook this guy. And then we'll show you. Everyone unhooked. Left this a beaky kind of bloody, but let's go let him go. Look at that. Yeah. Let's 
Let's go, buddy. Ooh, he took off quick. Let's go. You take off? Yep, he's, up. he's swimming away. Took me a lot longer than I wanted to, but we're finally in. Let's go. Let's hurry up because we got a, a time set before we gotta go. And I'm dying to hook into some fish. We hooked into some not too long ago, maybe like 15 minutes ago. But they still don't fight, fight as hard. Let's go check out what these guys got. You are muchos! Get yelling. Get glasses. Todo un poquito. ¿Eh? Sí, vamos a meter ahí a untar todo el ojo, el botón. A lot of different types of snapper and stuff. You can see them jumping. Look, they're busting right here. Once I get right close to that, I'm gonna put my legs down like this. Kind of slow down. Paddle in the back. Got the Zabuki rig. Just drop it in. into them before I go again. So this is going to be kind of boring because I don't see as many as the other day, but I'll turn on, I'll turn on the GoPro if I hurt it. So we're back in the hotel. We're walking to my hotel room. Uh, I'm back. I'm out of the kayak. We were, I was only in there for like 30 minutes. Yeah, we have to leave in like 30 minutes. We have to leave. So, gotta get everything packed up. Mostly everything's packed up. All I have is like my bag with GoPro stuff, rod, 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 and rod. So, oh, and yeah, no more GoPro stuff. But still, pretty much everything's packed up. We got the we got the two fish in here. We got the sword fit, the sailfish, and we got the. Uh, sailfish fillets in there so amazing very good experience here recommend it to anybody so I'm gonna get cleaned up and I'll see you guys back over there we're about to leave my parents are eating coconuts there's a ton of different kinds of candy and I found this it's pretty much I don't know what it's called in Spanish but it's a very good candy tamarindo it's called a tamarindo in Spanish. I don't know what it's called in English. It's a parrot. I gave him a corn puff and he tried to bite me. Put it down. One. You want another one? You dropped the first one right there. Hey! Corn pop. Hey! No, yeah, bite me. I'm trying to feed you corn pop. Yeah. You like that corn pop? <coughs> oh my goodness. So I'm getting that. Probably get some tamarindo. I'll probably get something to drink too.
That looks so good. Dude. Pretty much the same thing as these. With less sugar. We're more natural than everyone thought. Dude, I just got lucky. I found this. This is like the only bag that was there. Dude, what is this though? This kind of looks good. So I'm gonna keep looking around. Once we leave, I'll show you guys what I got, but I'm gonna keep looking. We're back in the camper. I ended up buying two of these. It's just basically tamarindo. It's called tamarindo. Um, it's candy. I bought mahi-mahi. Because, you know, I deserve it. And this, which is more tamarindo. I mean, I don't really, really like tamarindo, but when I want tamarindo, I get a lot of tamarindo. Either way, that's what I got, and um, we're on our way back, so. Good. There we go. Long trip, and uh, see what happens from here on out. There's a sailfish near here. Look at that. Nice fillet. Seizing it up. One of those. This is the seasoning we're using right here. They got it. Hey! Get it some coco! Yeah. Look at that. It looks a lot redder in the video than it actually is. Look at that. What? It is wrapped in, I think, three to four uh, wraps in tin foil, and then one just around like this. It's gonna go right over the fire. Look at that. We have a few more to prepare, and I guess we're not putting it on yet. Okay. But here's the next one. Next one, that's two, look at that, how pink it is. Ah! Look at that. This side was the side that had the skin, right? Yeah. Okay, we're gonna put this one on here. Oh, yeah. Hey. So we're gonna do these to all of them and then I'll film once we pull them out. Ooh. So I wasn't able to videotape because I was doing it myself, but that right there is where I, f I filleted both the bonita. Then once I filleted them, I got the, you know how it's the fillet, and they have the, and they have these little spine that goes through the middle. I cut that out, so it's boneless, boneless meat. Check this out. Look at that. I got almost 100% of the meat off. I don't really like the, the middle parts to like, I don't know, I don't know. And then that's what it is right there. I just dropped something, soda. But once we take it out, I'll videotape. We have the, I'm pretty sure the, yeah. Look at that. We have the sailfish on the grill right now. So we have the bonito over there. 
once it gets on uh i mean once we take it out of our videotape just to show you guys how amazing it's gonna be hopefully it tastes good i've never had a selfish i've had bonita bonita's really good but i did it a different way so let's see see how it turns out here's the the sailfish we just took it off the grill oh Perfect. Amazing. A little bit of lemon on it. Pruebelo, papá. Cálelo, a ver cómo, a ver qué. Miguel. Look at that. Look at that. We still got the bonita over there ready to cook. We got the other two fillets over there. Super, super good. It's a little bit hard. Mm. It's kind of hard, but it's a little hard, but at the same time, it's kind of chewy. It's kind of, it's not hard like beef. It's not um like pork. It's like fishy, but the meat is harder. It's not soft, if you kind of get what I'm saying. It is the next day, yesterday. Yesterday morning was our last day in Manzanillo. We were back at my house, as you guys can probably tell. But yesterday, whoa, I almost dropped my phone. Yesterday, um, we caught the two little weird-looking fish with teeth. Um, that was perfect description. Uh, then we went out of the kayak. We caught absolutely nothing. No bites. No nothing. Stopped at a coconut shop, got candy, drove all the way here, and cooked three of the fillets from the sailfish and the bonita. The bonita was freaking amazing. Sailfish was too, like, incredibly, was, like, hard. It was kind of hard. It was kind of, like, beef, sort of. Like, the meat texture was, like, beef in a way, but it was a little bit more crumbly. It was really good, uh... We ended up cutting it, like, cutting the meat, the fillet up, and then we made tortas. Um, well, at least I can say I had uh, selfish tortas. I'm pretty sure not a lot of people can say that, or even bonita tortas. Uh, we cut the bread, put the mayonnaise, meat, then uh, avocado or guacamole. There was both. And then a little bit of lime, salt, you know, ooh, it was really good. And now we have leftovers to eat today. But either way, I hope you liked or enjoyed the, I think it was three videos from the day we got to Manzanillo to, to actually no, I think it's four from the day to today. And today, or yesterday was the last day at the beach so I hope you guys enjoyed. Thanks for watching and I'll see you guys next in the next video.